Hey, what's up? This is DJ Good Concept, and I'm going to make a tutorial video about everything you need to know about FL Studios 9. Okay, first I'm going to open it up and go to my FL shortcut. Okay, what I'm going to show you is just basically everything that I've found out on my own. Well, Fruity Loops. So basically, first of all, you got your basics. You got a, your patterns and stuff. This random stuff for beginners. Just oh, just that doesn't help. Here, just figure out my speakers. I don't know if you can hear that. But anyways. So you can make patterns and stuff, with the, all that stuff, and first of all, to start making, I don't know, I'll show you, I'll show you how to make a techno song, just for example, because that's what I'm into. So you're going to want to open up, let me close everything down to make it a little more simpler for you. You're going to want to, okay, you got this playlist, or um, all these options here with all these different things like effects and generators and a bunch of different stuff and first of all you're going to want to make a a basic sound that you're going to base your song on so you can go into plugin presets and let me close that for you and you go to generators right here generators and you get to pick through all these different different kinds and sounds and stuff of generators. And for example, we'll go to Citrus, so that's my favorite. And now you get, you get all these choices too. Yeah, you here. Bass sound, brass, chromatic drum, DX7, whatever that is. Guitar, orchestral, pad, etc., etc. I can go to synth, st synth string. Can't really say that word, but we'll. and let's go to this angelic whistle. Sounds so cool. No, that's not very cool at all. No, that's not cool. But no, I don't want to show do a tutorial with that. So what you can do is you can go to a cool one, something I know that is cool, maybe like Hypersaw Heaven. That's cool. And drag that over it because we don't even want that whistle anymore. That sounds pretty cool. So I mean, right click and f first no, not don't right click. Actually no, I'll get into more advanced stuff after. I'm gonna right click, go to piano roll, click it. Now I have this. I can do everything. I click all those stuff. And I can go, the higher I go up the scroll bar, the higher in the noise. And I can go to this, something like that. I can go to ABC so I can find the notes. And that's what, this is what I prefer so I can I know, know what sounds good together. So let's make a, a little basic noise. So we got this and this is your play bar. You can click play. So there you go, that's the first noise. So then I'm gonna go to my E and drop it down to a B. I'm gonna go to an A. And I can shorten it by scrolling like that. Clicking and scrolling, click scroll. So basically we got this first little bit. So that sounds kind of lame, but whatever. Then I'm going to go up go up here. So here, let's listen to this so far. So 
sounds kind of lame, but that's how, that's how it is. Then, also, this quote button right here, up in this area, I clicked it, right there.